Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video, we're taking a look at another Lego Polybag. And this one is Polybag 30361, the City Fire ATV. And I gotta tell you, I'm already kind of excited about the fireman with that axe. Kind of a neat looking axe. Anyway, let's take a look at this. Now, if you enjoy this kind of video, please think about subscribing because I am doing one of these videos a day, every day, for the foreseeable future. And I have also done one of these videos a day, every day, for the not so recent past. This is, we're in the 150s, so about maybe five months of these. So if you like this kind of video, please think about checking out some of the other ones. And there's a playlist on my channel that has all of the polybag build-alongs in order, if you're interested. And there's also links in the description where you can find this particular set on Bricklink and on Amazon. And there's the brick set link if you just want information about this particular set itself. Alright, so... Give the dude his fire hat. And this is the thing I was curious about. Let's take a look at this. All right. That's a pretty cool looking fire axe, isn't it? I mean, like, it looks pretty good. I'm, I'm not unhappy with that fire axe. And so our fire, a oops, our fire ATV guy just lost his helmet. But our fire ATV guy gets a cool looking fire axe and we also built him a little fire extinguisher which I think is a pretty good use of these two pieces it very much implies fire extinguisher so we got that like so wow I keep popping off his hat I guess it's the weird angle I'm holding him and he hasn't got any legs yet alright we'll give him his legs and maybe managed not to pop off his head a third time. All right, that's actually a pretty good-looking fireman minifig. I mean, like he's got a fire axe, which looks really good, and the fire extinguisher. I'm pretty happy with that. All right, so his little ATV looks to be relatively simple. Let's check it out. So, so what do y'all think about the city stuff? I'm kind of, I, I have liked most of the stuff I've looked at city-wise, and I just, I don't know, I don't know why I disliked the city so much when I was little, and why I have liked it more as an adult. Maybe I need to delve into some of the, some of the, like, more space stuff and see, and check that out. Because I loved me some space before, and maybe, so we get extra brake lights, I guess, for this one, because we had the, the red right here for the brake light, and we have that for the brake light. Hmm. And that, and this is going to be the front of our vehicle. Actually, pretty easy. I mean, like, there's not, there's not a huge amount of like complicated stuff going on right here. So, I got a couple of these clips, and these clips, I would assume, will hold the fire axe and the fire extinguisher if he weren't carrying them. So now we got that. So that gets us to right there. And then put this on the back, right there on top of that. And then the one by two T slope goes there. And this one goes here. And then I'm sort of combining steps here because I know where it's headed. This is going to be our, like, 
handlebar thing like so and then we put some headlights on put some headlights on the front like so and then the kind of bumper grill thing goes up there that looks really good I like the look of that all right and then we're gonna do the blue light thing on the top and this is gonna clip up to here I'm not crazy about the look of that I feel like it should be a little better attached but yeah you can see right there that's where we attach the fire extinguisher and that's where we attach the the axe where we so inclined and then lastly we just pop on the wheels I like the looks of these wheels I like the kinda these aren't the giant wheels they're like mid-size wheels I guess they look pretty good so this is our ATV and this is our dude and we have an extra clear one and an extra uh, fire extinguisher handle thing as our extra pieces so if we want to put these here we just flip them like so and they clip this upside down according to the instructions so I'll clip it the same way and then the dude gets in and he can drive around his fire ATV like so hmm. not bad I like this one it's got a bunch of neat little things I like the I like the axe. I like the fire extinguisher. I like the overall look of the ATV. I, I mean, I, I'm pretty impressed with the fireman. He's a, I mean, he's a decent, except for him losing his hat so much. I think he's a decent looking minifig fireman. And then he can just drive around. Now that he's had his hands adjusted where he can actually drive. There we go. Although I think I just displaced his handlebar. There we go. So, yeah. Not bad. I like this one. My only complaint is this little thing right here. Hmm. Anyway, what do y'all think? Is it a neat one or not? I'm going to go with yeah. I, I like this one. Although... Yeah, I like this one. I'm I'm pretty happy with almost every aspect of this. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And I hope y'all have an excellent day.